Segalon's former president, Enes Bai Koroma, has been charged with four offenses including treason for his alleged involvement in a failed military attempt to overthrow the government in November. Enes Bai Koroma was placed under house arrest on December 9, 2023. Until then, he had been considered a suspect. He had been questioned by police on several occasions. The charges come amid heightened tensions following the coup attempt and the disputed elections in June 2023, in which President Julius Madabio secured a second term. The election results was rejected by many opposition candidates and met with skepticism from international partners. In November 2023, gunmen attacked military barracks and prison, resulting in the release of 2,200 inmates with more than 20 deaths. The government blamed the incident on the foil coup, mainly involving Koroma's bodyguards. The ex-president, who has been in charge with treason, treasonable felony and harboring, condemned these attacks. His lawyers described the charges as a political vendetta. Koroma was granted bail and the case was adjourned until January 17. Twelve others, including members of Koroma's security detail, were also charged with treason in connection with the coup attempt.